I do speak on the fact that um, God protects me and God guides me and I talk to God. You know, I speak on these things and he's like, oh, you sound calm. And I'm like, no, sweetie, you must, you, you, you're mistaking me for this other woman that he's dealing with because, baby, there's a difference, <laughs> you know. There, there's a big, big, big fact, big difference, you know, and energy, energy, my energy speaks for itself. I don't have to assert my power in order for you to realize and know who I am in spirit, because I know that my energy speaks for me. I'm kind, I'm sweet, I'm loving, I'm confident, but I'm also a warrior. And so I, I let that be, it, it speaks through me it speaks in my presence it speaks in my body language it speaks in the way that I handle other people the way that I handle kids the way that I handle someone who's going through things you know these a lot of a lot of the things that um like you won't catch me walking around talking about how powerful I am or how I can do this and how they can't do that and how like you would you would you would never catch me trying to put someone else down to make myself feel good that's not what power is if you have to put someone else down to make yourself feel good then baby you are already beneath the person that you're talking about the fact that you have to speak down upon them it really it it, it it speaks on how fur how how far up under them you actually are so you're actually looking up to this person but you're trying to bring them down to your level and if this person is as powerful as you see them then baby they would never stoop down to your stoop down to your level i'm just saying let's get into it though i get see this is one of those topics for me that gets me going because i i deal with this on a daily basis um i've been dealing with this since i was a young girl and it's 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 like it makes you put the stink face on when you're looking at someone because it's like who the fuck do you think you are who are you talking to like, who are you really, really, really trying to do this to? Like, I've done nothing to you. I've said nothing wrong to you. But you want to make me feel some type of way? Okay, so now all that means is you you, you don't have you don't need to be in my energy. So now when I try to treat you a certain type of way, not to say that it's mean or not to say that it's um rude but it's just it's a protection mechanism so now i will walk past you as if i don't know you i i don't have to speak to you i don't have to hold a conversation with you especially if every time i have a conversation with you you try to downplay all of my accomplishments or you try to make me feel as though i am not moving forward or you try to make me feel as though i have done something wrong no no, I don't have to conversate with you. I don't care how godly I am. I don't care how much power I have. This is what it means to be a person of power. I don't have to do anything that I don't want to do. I am the sole proprietor of my own energy. I am in control of my own energy. I am in control of my own emotions. I am in control of my own physical vessel. And therefore, I don't have to do anything that I do not want to do. And if you're not respecting me and I have to put up boundaries to protect my peace and to protect my sanity and to, and to um, protect my mental health and my power, because our power lies in our emotions. And so if I allow you to fuck with my emotions and play with my emotions, now I have to... Uh, that means I'm giving you my power. So you're, if, you're, if you're trying to take my power, then that means you have no power. And if I give you my power, then that means you, you now have power. No, 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 no. I'm going to keep mine. What we're going to do about that is I'm going to keep my power right over here with me. And you can go try to penny pinch off of somebody else's energy. You can go and try to um, manipulate your way into someone else's energy. Because real beings um, where I come from, like spiritually, where I come from, I, I am aware that I'm not from this place. And so where I come from, if you have to manipulate or bend someone else's will to get your way, you are considered lower level. You are a lower level being. 
you know, but if you put in the work to achieve your goals and you go out and work for what it is you have and you're respecting people, you gaining your power from giving, like it's a giving, it's a giving type of thing where I come from. You get what you give, you get what you give. So if I go around and I continue to give out good energy and I give out good, 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 good mojo, you know, what do you think is going to come to me? How do you think I get so powerful? How do you think I get so protected? How do you think I get so loved by the universe and by the gods because of what I put out into the world? And you can't, you can't be upset with someone because they possess this type of energy or this type of power when they put in the work for this. They didn't kill anybody for this. You see, there's a difference in fear A lot of people think that you can get power from fear. If you put fear into somebody, they'll do what you want them to do. No, a person that fears you will kill you way before a person that respects you. I don't want fear. I want respect. That's it and that's all. I don't want, I don't want, even though I know that my sword is powerful, the tongue, my my words are powerful. I can take a life. I can't, these things I know. I know that I can cause certain things to happen and the universe will answer to it. Why? Because of who I am in spirit my heart is pure and so what I ask for I receive so I'm very 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 careful with the things that I go around saying especially about other people you know and and you think that that fear is going to okay for example I'm gonna give you an example um it's not really so much of an example but it's it's a You can line it up. So a person of fear, like say for instance, a bully, right? A bully, they have, um, you're bullying someone constantly with your words, bullying, bullying, bullying. You're constantly fucking with this person. You know, you might get physical with them sometimes. And this person deep down in their heart are not even that like, even like threatening someone with their freedom or their lives now you can do this for so long but this person fears you so if they have to defend themselves they're more likely to take you out then you take them out. You'll get taken out by a person that that fears you before you get taken out by anything else. So 